While driving to Da Nang, we saw this girl shucking oysters on the side of the road. Take a close look and check out her face mask. Once we got there, we walked into the restaurant. Lots of bicycles and scooters. Along the way, there were many street vendors cooking on the sidewalk. Lots of places to get a drink. Always a fresh coconut available. Dickie can't resist. There was an open barber shop where this local was getting a nose hair trim. Gross. Once you got to the restaurant, they sat us at a long table. Everyone was there. As always, we start with the local beer. It was hot outside and the cold beer went down easily. Our happy waiter brought us some dipping sauce. A sweet, spicy chili sauce and soy. They were for the spring rolls, a quick dip and a bite. I poured mine over the spring roll, picked it up and took a bite. They were just okay. They lacked flavor. I went back to the kitchen. It was clean and very efficient. Next, a shrimp and noodle dish. It was served on a rice pancake. The flavor was lacking. The hitman ate all of his. Mixed vegetables. Again, the seasoning and flavor were just not there. Tofu and vegetables in a light sauce. It was served with steamed rice. Nancy eats hers like a local. While in Rome. Everyone ate. Eggs and vegetables. We finished with fresh fruit. Local watermelon, mango, and pineapple. Our waitress wanted to have her picture taken with us. They were fantastic and very happy. They wanted Nancy in the picture. On the way back, we went by the famous China Beach in Vietnam. The food was okay, but the people were great. We gave White Lotus three stars.